What's what's up guys, it's those remote guys, and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Canon PowerShot SX500 IS digital camera. So let's get into it. First thing we have on the bottom is some cool features, including the 16 megapixels. It comes with a 30 optical zoom, 24 millimeter wide lens, and a 3 inch LCD screen on the back. It also says it comes in HD, so that's cool. If we flip it and I show you the front side, it's basically showing you the camera again, the company, and the model or the type of camera. Left side, we have Canon PowerShot SX500 IS repeated once again, and the interior, or I should say the inside panel of the camera. So, next, if I push this closer to the camera you can see the contents which include the uh, camera obviously the neck strap the battery charger the battery pack an interface cable and a CD which has software um, next we have basically the price uh, tag and it says just the type of color you got this camera in, which I got black as you can see on the top so let's go ahead and open it up first thing we see is a Canon limited warranty. I'm going to want to fill that out as soon as you start getting comfortable with your camera and are sure you uh, are keeping it. Next you're going to keep or er, next you're going to want to read the PowerShot SX500 IS um, instruction manual and the uh, getting started guides. It comes in English and Spanish, I believe, so that's helpful. Um, we uh, also have the digital camera solutions disk which comes with software. So that's good. And there's a little piece of cardboard to protect the uh, valuable stuff. So first thing we have on the side is a strap, a neck strap, which says power shot on it. It's probably going to be pretty comfortable, I would uh, assume. Next we have the battery. And the battery comes in this blue little bag, obviously. And um, it basically has this uh, little cap to put on the battery and the battery is uh, pretty small actually it's half a finger I'd say of my finger at least so pretty small that's nice pretty light as well enough about the battery here's the USB cable in case you wanna plug your camera into your computer your cable or other USB um, technology things you know like charging and maybe but you won't need to use that cable, in fact, for the charger, obviously, because this camera does come with a nice wall mount charger. And the thing I like about wall mount chargers are they save a lot of time. Instead of having to get out that uh, cable and uh, untangle it and all that, you could just pop the little plug out, pop the battery in, plug it in, and uh, this one's pretty uh, nice. It doesn't feel cheap, actually. Obviously, it is made of plastic, but... Um, very compact and looks pretty nice. It also has the lights that show when it's charging and when it's full. So yeah, there's the charger. Now let's get to the last thing, obviously, the camera. So first thing you see when you take the camera out is um, there's a lens cap that comes with it. And lens cap yeah, uh, first when you unbox it, it actually isn't um, automatically tied on to the camera. I don't know why they didn't do that. I guess some people don't like this lens cap, but it's a nice lens cap, I think, and does the job. So I'll put that back on there. Um, it also comes with a manual flash. You just pop it up with your two fingers grabbing the side. That's pretty cool. We have uh, many cool features that come with the camera, such as the video record mode you could slide to, and you also have the uh, scanning mode up top, and several other modes you should uh, know if you're into photography. Next we have the on and off button, obviously to turn the camera on. We have the 3 inch LCD uh, screen, pretty nice picture I think, that uh, displays what you have taken. Um. These buttons down here, I guess this is to control the brightness. The uh, review buttons right here. The other method for recording, just easier, is just tap that button if you don't want to go and scroll to the video camera. Um, we also have the ISO settings, the function settings, the uh, self timer, the flash, and the uh, 
looks like the microfocus and uh, other things relating to the, er, I'm sorry, macro, I mean, <laughs> sorry guys. Um, we also have the display button to get rid of all the stuff on the screen if you just want to see the picture and not all the settings. And we have the menu to adjust even more settings, obviously. And uh, on the bottom we have the tripod mount, normal tripod mount. Um, we also have some information regarding the model number. So if you ever need your model number, it's right there. On the, uh, I guess you'd say the left side. We have, it does say it comes with 30 optical zoom, plenty of zoom, that's a lot actually. And I believe, do believe this camera does come with 120 digital zoom it goes up to, so that's a lot. Trust me, I, I don't think I'll, I'll ever need to use that, but nice feature. I'm um, not too sure what this one does, probably something simple, but I'm sure it's helpful. I haven't really gone to in depth with this camera, obviously. And uh, yeah, that's basically... The unboxing for you it's got a nice grip on the front uh, easy to hold lightweight um, kind of like a mini DSLR almost so uh, I hope you guys like this video please like it favorite it and subscribe it helps a lot and it helps me to make more videos like this and um, I also want to continue to uh, do this um, giveaways like, I want to continue to do giveaways um, we just chose our winner for the Gamefly giveaway, so that's over if you guys were uh, subscribed. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching, and this is Those Remote Guys.